The leading rusher in the conference behind Marshall, but he's going to flare it out again this time to Ricardo Lewis. They use Ricardo on a lot. Very dangerous to contain him. He'll throw for it. Three swing passes in a row, and they're going to get the first down. That's Rock Thomas, the three. Lewis in motion, they fake it to him, and it's Marshall who will get the carry, and they got back to the line of scrimmage, and that's about it. The dogs knock him back, but about nine and a half right here. Marshall play action. Deep middle. High and almost picked off. They're coming after Marshall here. He gets the pass away, and this one's caught. 30 for the Georgia 44. And finally, the leading rusher in the conference, Cameron Artis Payne, gets a kick. Second down and five. Blitz coming off the corner. Artis Payne takes it the other way. And Marshall will do it himself. And he got the first, and he got a bunch more. Outside the tackles on the perimeter. School record for the quarterbacks for Auburn in 100-yard games. Artis Payne follows his blockers beautifully, heads to the sideline, and the end zone. Touch the 14-yard line. And this one. You got to get lined up, and you don't know. On the offense, number 82, lined up in the neutral zone. Artis Payne. Cuts in the middle and found an opening. And he's going to have 10. It looks like a first down, second down, and one. And he gets it again. He's dropped for a loss. Artis Payne, they fake it to him. Marshall trying to dance his way through, and he does. Out to the receiver, down at the bottom of the screen. Artis Payne, little hesitation, and then he puts. They'll get another carry, trying to bounce it outside. Georgia won't let him this time. Fourth time they've been third down and three or less. This time he gives it to Payne again. Little quick opening draw, and he might be. Doesn't matter who the coach is either. I mean, they've changed coaches, and they, <laughs> they still keep grinding it out. Here's Artis Payne, a pretty good running back in his own right. Got about a yard later before this snap. And on second down and eight, it's a swing pass again. Out to Marcus Davis. Nice move. Marshall, plenty of time, down the middle, and complete Sammy Coates, and he's all over an offense this year. This time, he's going to keep it himself. Heading to the sideline, Georgia stretches it out pretty well, and at the Georgia 48-yard line. Second down and six, Ricardo Lewis in motion. Marshall to throw, and he throws it in the ground. Lewis was... Right, that's what Marshall's done. He's got two receivers to each side. Marshall in trouble here, throws on the run, and he got it over. Flag down. It would be a first down, but I think we're going to have a holding. 19 quarterback holding. pressures. Offense 72. 10 yard penalty. Can't relax, even though it's third and long. Third and 16. They're going to throw a little slip screen out to the outside. Leonard Floyd was waiting for that one. He's still going to make the tackle, I think. Great night. Only 14 yards, but he's a big play receiver. Artis Payne got to the 20, maybe the 21. Artis Payne straight ahead. He's not going to get the first down category coming into today's play. And he's not. Yes, he is. Second effort, he got it. In the football. Georgia Tech, big winner at home today over Clemson. Play action. And the ball with Artis Payne in a season. He'll get it again. Run smack him to Rameek Wilson. I mean, that is high percentage stuff. And this is the quarterback all the way. Marshall is going to go down before he can even get to the game of Auburn. As we mentioned earlier, Auburn with the number one rushing club in the SEC. Georgia number two. Nick Marshall loads and goes long over the top of ever the last decade in college football. Marshall running out of time, comes back. Intended nine seconds left to work with. It'll be a swing pass, a screen out to Artis Payne. <laughs> and Georgia didn't want to give up a touchdown on a play like So one more play here, barring a defensive penalty. Marshall loads and fires. And it's almost caught by Lewis. Dig their way up. He seems to have a tendency to be able to play action. Nick Marshall. Deep down the middle. Coach had it right between the one and Georgia's defense is a big part of that. 
Play fake again, and again deep down the middle. This time, in and out of the hands of 10. Georgia four-man rush. Marshall flags all over the place. He's going to run for the first down, but it's coming back. Holman again. Holding. Offense 72. 10-yard penalty. They keep it on the ground. That was conservative, but there's no situation. And they're going to have to definitely do what Gus told Holly, and that's try to fire on all cylinders every time they have it. Because first down at the 42. Marshall again will run it. And again, good positive right now with 6.45 remaining in the third quarter. Artis Payne cuts it outside. He's got a first down, and he's taking Damian Swan for their run game. Inside run this time, not much for Artis Payne. Same way George is doing tonight. Second down and eight. Marshall goes deep on the sideline. In He's going to run for it, but he won't get anywhere near. Only about a yard. They fake the end around. Marshall running out of time. Incomplete. The dogs take up. Getting to the run game. This team ran for 363 last week against AM, struggling tonight to get their running game going. Ricardo Lewis on a sweep. Brought down after about a final seconds of the third quarter. Corey Grant joins Marshall. He play fakes it there and throws it right back to him. And now they're set. Artis Payne. Weaves it. Auburn has outscored their opponents by 59 points. Marshall down the middle. That's a strike. And it's Sammy Coates. And finally, they're going to have to worry about time of possession. As their scoring drives normally don't take that long. And they might have one coming up here. Flag down, though, back at the line of scrimmage. Arden. Holding. Offense 62. 10 yard penalty for spot of the foul. Georgia defense. They've done a nice job in fourth quarters this year. They're going to need another fourth quarter comeback to even be in this one. Marshall running out of time, and at the last, he has to get down 16. They fake it to Grant. And Marshall deep in the middle again. Got it complete. Came out of his break into an opening. Corey Grant, and Grant popped out the backside of a pileup and got nine yards. And first down, needed his top linebackers. Todd was talking about on the sideline here on a first down. Artis Payne dropped for a loss. Marshall fires near side infants. Marshall fires goal line broken up. Marshall. Flushed out of the pocket. Throws back across his body, and it's intercepted. Auburn has never failed to score at least 20 points in a game under Gus Malzahn, and they might not get another chance. All game tonight. Johnson throws, broken up. And not give up big, cheap plays, and they didn't do that. Johnson down the middle, completes. That's going to be one of their bigger games of the night. Melvin Ray on the receiving end of the group with him. Now one of those new defensive coaches is. A little over three minutes remaining. A little swing pass out to Rock Thomas. And Thomas is going to get to the first down, I think. 30-pounder. Big-time arm. More on the Cam Newton size. And. And Tuesday night we'll find out the new rankings. This is a this is pretty impressive. There's another fumble. George is gonna cover it. 